Time now, 617. We have new details this morning in the disappearance of a Fort Hood soldier. The attorney for the family of Vanessa Guillen says Army investigators have positively identified her remains more than two months after she first disappeared. CBS4's Nancy Chen reports on the demand now for a congressional investigation. Mourners came together in Houston over the weekend to remember Army Specialist Vanessa Guillen and demand justice. The 20-year-old Houston native was last seen in late April. Vanessa joined the Army to serve her country, but her own country didn't protect her. So that's why we chose the 4th of July as well, to make a statement. According to court documents, Specialist Aaron Robinson beat Guillen to death with a hammer at Fort Hood. Her family says it was after she told Robinson she would report him for sexual harassment. She went into the Army, you know, thinking it was a safe place for her to be there. And, you know, the Army failed her. Robinson's girlfriend, Cecily Aguilar, is accused of helping him dismember and hide Guillen's body. The Army says Robinson died by suicide last week as officers tried to arrest him. Hundreds gathered near Fort Hood Friday night. This atrocity should have never happened, and it should have been done and taken care of that day that she was missing. Guillen's family accuses the Army of covering up how Guillen was treated and is now calling for a congressional investigation. They have lied to us multiple times, and that's one of the lies. My sister was sexually harassed multiple times. The Army says there's no credible evidence so far Robinson or anyone else sexually harassed Guillen. Nancy Chen, CBS News.